Hey guys, it's JackSpar123 and today we are on the Gaming Evolved modded server and I know everything looks a little different. Billy has some like hexagon type skins on him and so does Kaw and we got a bionic bat which I will name right now. Ooh, bat. Now, Zubat is not going to be used very often. He is only a defense measurement. So, we won't touch Zubat barely. I mean, like, we might toy around with him sometimes. But, today I'm going to show you how to get this hive. Also, we are on my pirate ship for this season. I know it looks derpy. But, it's for modded, so it's defense purposes. So, first of all... To get the hive skin, you gotta have the anti node mod. And then an anti node, you gotta craft one of these. So let's craft one. It takes a little bit of time, but it's worth it. I have increased crafting speed. So. <laughs> and then you can't get. Well, actually, I can't get upgrades because I have no clue how. Yeah. And then what you want is either a roll tank scout or something, which we want murder. But I'll also show you the simple type. You have weight, speed, and all of that. They use different stuff. So, like, weight requires sap, and so does other stuff, you know. But we want murder, because this is going to be for Zubat over here. Because Zubat is going to be a murdering thing. Next thing you need is this PCB workstation. Once you open it, you get a window like this, and... I normally just put one in and we have two murderers so we attach the murder and then it attaches the murder to this model I know I'm really bad at tutorials don't judge me I have feelings too so yeah once we have this done which it is right about now we come here which one is it? And we gotta look for the module with the symbol on it. Okay, it just finished. Here it is, right here. And then what we do is we come over the Subat and to make him look even more robot-y, we come here, we go like that, and then we go remote use. Did it even work on him? There we go. Oh wait, that took it off of him. Here. Yeah, he has it on him now. Okay, and now, look at this damage. This is stupid. Yeah, that's why we don't use Zubat. I mean, like, we can use it to clean out stuff that are too close to our ship or that are going to destroy our ship. But I don't think I'm ever going to use him for, like, killing bosses or stuff. Because that was a level 120 T-Rex. I just got one shot. Because I deal 1 million damage. So, yeah. Kind of broken. Post in the comments what you think. Next thing we're doing today, besides breaking Zubat and making this game super easy, is I want to make some tech armor. Oh, gosh. Why is that thing so close to... I also put some sentries on top of my ship, so those should be kicking in any second now. Let's uh, test out the sentries. Okay, so... Um... I guess nothing can really get close to our base. And let's land Zubat here. And as you see on Billy, it's a lot more visible, but on Zubat, there's only the rings around his face and arms and stuff. But with Billy, he has the exact same module, which is murder. So he does a lot of damage, and it's legit damage. So I'll just quickly show that off. There is a poor little. Actually, we're. We're, we're going to have to find a dino. Pretty sure, yep. You already barely survived. So that's 19 damage. 
19k damage and that's 104k damage so yeah that's a lot of damage and now we gotta hope that Billy can jump all the way back to the nope rip Billy not going to be allowed on the ship anymore Billy's been through a lot he killed um what's it called mega dodo or something it was a giant zombie dodo and Billy killed it with ease So Billy's been like our little trump card. It's been really useful having Billy. You just kind of run at something and use Billy to like swat it. Really. But I know Billy's not going to be able to take on everything. So that's why we have Zubat now. Now Zubat, I want him to follow the ship. So let's come here. We go like this. And then we look at Zubat, and no, not Billy. Come on. There we go, Zubat's all good. So now Zubat will follow the ship. And hopefully Billy didn't just fall off. Nope. So, another thing I want to do is tame a Dunkleostal. A Dunkleostal. Also, we need a new, uh, a new whatever it was called. Sorry about the cannons. They get a little bit much. But we lost our Diplocolis, I think. He didn't die. He just kind of disappeared off the ship. So, we're kind of missing him. Let's, uh... Ka has a different kind of module. He has a scout type module. Alpha Dodo Wishbone. Anyway, so the scout module pretty much just makes him a whole lot faster. So we can scout out the area. And... If I could find... Those are normal on it. That's a wyvern that we don't want to get after our ship. Because then... Zubat will actually have to do something. Hopefully Zubat can keep up with the ship. Where'd our ship go? There it is. Where is Zubat? Is he literally inside the ship? No, we don't want him in the ship. We want him on the outer area. So what we gotta do is take his follow distance. Change his Follow distance. No. Come on. Left, me, right. Come on. Darn it. Do back. Let's get him out of here. There we go. And we can just dismount him back here. This way he's close to the ship, able to attack anything that attacks us. And safety. Safety stuff. We also have Pokeballs just in case anything bad comes after us. You know, like the occasional swimming Giga, which is actually just a Mosasaur. Yeah. And then we also have... What's it called? Oh, yeah. I got this sword. This is what I was going to show. It's a really good sword. Here, I'll show you the damage on Billy. Now, if I press I, just look at my melee damage right here. I pretty much maxed it. So, that's a lot of damage. Especially against a dinosaur. Normally I would one shot them, not Billy, not Billy, Billy's been leveled up and stuff, and he has a module on. But what I mean by I could probably one shot him is cause his dinosaur type isn't normally a high level. Oh wait, I just realized, we can craft something else, where is it? Consumables crafted, no not that. Uh, no. No. Huh. 
Also, I could make this armor, but for some odd reason, the black pearls aren't working. So I'll figure that out another time. Or if someone comes on, I'll ask about it. So yeah. Another thing is, if you remember, Syntac gave me this gun. Now, what this gun can do is essentially knock out any dinosaur with one shot. One shot! Okay, I'm not going to start with that. Also, what we have is a level 882 or 88? 85, oh, in between. Apex Lightning Wiver Nade. Now, I want to hatch that. So, what we need is Apex Wiver Milk. And to get that, we need to find a female Apex Wyvern. So, that's another reason why I got Kaw on this Scout type. So that we could do stuff like this. Now, I know that there's a Wyvern just over here. Like, not even too far. I'm scared I'll run into it. Okay, let's, uh, let's knock it out. Actually, first... Oh, shoot, that's a manticore. Hopefully, it's not mad at me. Okay, let's check what level it is. Okay, so it went out a few distance. You gotta be female for me to knock you out. Did it say male? Ah, oh, it's male. Okay, well, let's knock it out and kill it. Oh shoot, there was a wyvern right behind those trees. Wyverns are everywhere. I swear. Oh, I see. There's a nest right over there. Um, how are we going to do this? The manticore will completely wreck us. So, maybe we could use Zubat to get some dinosaurs killed actually the poison wyverns would probably ruin my day by killing me off Zubat if I could find my ship too that would help okay yeah that's what we're going to do we are going to use Zubat I know it's not an emergency but it is to me actually so I guess it is a bit of an emergency because that wyvern egg only has two more days. Only two more days. I keep aiming for that part of the ship when I don't need to. Okay, let's go over to Zubat. Okay, let's go clean house. He should be able to. He doesn't have the best HP, but he's not bad. Um... Where is that manticore I saw? There it is. Hopefully it's laid its egg by now. If it didn't, then rip. But really, it's in the way of what I want to do today. There we go. Oh, that was a prime. Shoot. Well... It's dead now. Press X while mounted. Place in Manticore inventory. Is that a Manticore egg or is that a firewood? Okay, let's just quickly kill stuff around here. Fire Wyvern level 540. Okay, let's get rid of this Wyvern. Don't turn around, don't turn around. There we go. <sighs> That's actually really stressful. So, I guess Wyverns like this lake over here. You better be female. You gotta somehow get it right on. 
Come on. Come on now. Female. There we go. Yep. This is what we are after. The female weapon. I think it's landing right now. Yeah. This should be easy. Don't knock me off. Thank you. That had to have hit. Please tell me this is actually working. Oh shoot, can I even get back to Suba? Oh, oh no. Okay, good. Where'd that wyvern go? Hmm. How particular. The wyvern seems to have left the area. Let's uh, increase his melee damage more. With my experience, the moment I start increasing that health is the moment they start dying. So, yeah. But also, that's a level 1000 wyvern. Ooh, maybe that's its egg down there. Ooh, that would be so cool. Okay, let's uh... Try and shoot it. Oh, shoot. Thank you, Zubat. Okay. Let's, uh... Make sure that we check the area now. This time. Ooh, what's in here? Another Fire Wyvern. Funny, I'm not seeing any Fire Wyverns. That's a level 540. Not that bad of an egg. Okay, where is that nest I saw that this wyvern seems to love? Okay, is this it? Is that a poison wyvern egg? Oh boy, that's so good. Pick it up. Fly like a madman. That wyvern should be chasing us now, right? Let's uh, just fly this way. Just keep flying, just keep flying. What do we do when we fly? fly? Oh, there's the fire wyverns that we were looking for. And I don't see it. Where'd it go? There's a lightning wyvern. There's a T-Rex. Let's just head back to our raft because I am nervous about my diamonds. That's a male lightning wyvern. We don't want males. Come on. Come here, buddy. There we go. Oh, there's a fire wyvern. What level are you? Please be female. No, you're a male. 805. Not a bad level. I think you laid that egg, didn't you? I know I'm asking it questions. It's a stupid dragon, says the viewers. Oh no! Zubat! Fly, Zubat, fly! Okay, I had to kill a really good wyvern. I am not happy. I could have just flown away. I'm stupid. Let's increase the movement speed a little bit. Increase the damage a little bit more. That's much better. Okay, now what we gotta do... Oh, there's that poison wyvern. I have that poison wyvern's egg, so haha. -ha. I actually rather have a lightning wyvern, because in full honesty, they're a lot better. 
So right now, we gotta figure out a way to knock out this wyvern. I shouldn't take too, too many shots. Only like one or two. Maybe three at most. Possibly four. Okay, where is this poison? Oh, there's that poison wyvern. Okay. I saw a nest over here. What's in it? Level 5, 440. Now, in full honesty, all of these wyvern eggs are really good. Okay, please be a level 1000 or something. Nope. And I'm too much of a scaredy cat to try and kill it or take those eggs and eat it and then fly away. But in full honesty, I can. Okay. Oh shoot, there's a boss raptor. Uh, no. I'm not going to kill it. That would be unfair, because this thing can one-shot everything. Right now, at least it can. Maybe not in the future if we debuff them. You know, make them weaker. Easy stuff. Um... So, off-cam, I'm probably going to be getting wyvern milk and stuff. Maybe I might have the wyvern before I record next, but I probably won't. Because I don't think I need to record that. Or I need to record getting the wyvern. Anyways, so that's going to be all for this episode. If you enjoyed, please be sure to hit the like button and comment down below what was your favorite part. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye bye Okay guys, I know I said I was done recording, but not in the least amount. We got the wyvern knocked out and we got wyvern milk. Now, uh, I guess you guys probably want to know how much wyvern milk I got. Well, to say the least, it was around 15 or 14. Now, you might be asking, Jack, why are you flying away from your ship? Well, that is because my friend Neo has a hatchery and he also has a wyvern now what do I want I want to borrow that hatchery for just a few minutes and either way I don't think he's going to mind at all oh gosh I'm stuck on the bat and my FPS is trash okay there we go I know it's really laggy but this is because it's just such a cool base. Okay, now I guess what I just do is drop the wyvern on top. It is incubating. Oh my gosh! Um, let's just hatch it in here. Let's name you Bolt. J S. Bolt is our wyvern. He, he wants care in 20 seconds. 60. Whatever's being attacked outside is going to die in just a second. Okay. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. No, oh, shoot. I should probably do this. Okay, good. He just wanted to cuddle. How good are his stats? And is this just plain wyvern milk? Yeah, I, I could have done this either way. Uh, anyways, so the wyvern is really strong in this game. Well, duh, because it's modded. Okay, so I can't change his distance. Change follow distance, medium, high, highest, low, low. Okay, yeah, that was a good choice. Come on, Bolt. Just 
through that door. Through the door to your new home. There we go. He's almost at 100%. Wow. Okay. Let's see how good his turning radius is. Oh gosh. I see why they're called Apex Wyverns. Their turning radius is awesome. And his stats are unreal. So I'll let this guy... Okay, so Bolt grew up, decided to kick the butt out of some poor things out here. Where'd Bolt go? Oh, okay. You can come over here, Bolt. You stupid wyvern.
Okay, FPS drop. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, now we do have a bit of an issue. We got a zombie dodo right here. That I'ma just get rid of because it is really close to the space. And I don't think Neo wants a zombie dodo at his base. There we go. Job done. Oh shoot. Alpha Dimorphodon blood. That's what Syntax said I needed to get the giant Dimorphodon. And I got a GPS. Thank you, game. Where about is this last? There we go. I got a lot of Alpha Dimorphodon blood. Okay. Now, if I just sit here. Okay, let's just let him land. He's going to land wherever he wants. Eventually. Okay, come on. This isn't rocket science. Just sit there. Thank you. Oh gosh. Interesting. A bow and some more Dimorphodon leech blood. Dimorphodon leech blood, yes. Okay, now the thing I want to test out is this. Mago says it turns into a zombie that will kill you, but that's why we have Zubat here. Just so that no nothing bad happens. So let's do it right now. It says press X, right? Press X while mounted. Press X. Nothing happens. Place in zombie. Oh, place in your zombie wyvern inventory. Whoops, I was using the wrong one. Let's use a dodo brain. Press X while in wyvern's inventory. Okay. You can sit still. Okay, sure, let's go for a joyride. There we go. Okay. What the heck is my wyvern on? Okay, let's do it. Place in wyvern's inventory, press X moment. Oh shoot! Mako was right. Okay, oh never mind, my wyvern's gone. Nothing bad happened. What? Mago! Where is the evil wyvern? Anyways, what I do know is that it placed my wyvern in my inventory. So let's use it. Whoa. That is so cool looking. Not bad stats either. Actually, normal movement speed. Look at this thing. Looks so cool. Let's uh, see how much damage it does. What the heck? So so can attack and everything. That was really awkward. Let's uh 
land and see if I get... Nope. Anyways, yes, I do have the cheats on. I didn't do anything with them. So, let's uh, quickly go test out what the wyvern can do. Not very much damage. That one attack, though, is a lot. Let's increase his uh, melee damage. I thought it was going to go up by a lot more. Lightning with me. Whoa, that was a level 1080. That should have been tamed. Oh well. Mistakes happen. Let's increase his... Actually, his HP is really low. Let's increase that to like... I'd say right about... Let's go up a little bit extra, right there. And let's increase his movement speed a little bit. And let's get that melee damage. It's covered in blood, and he has a lot of attack damage. <laughs> this is awesome. That is so cool. He does so much damage and kills literally everything he attacks. If only trees didn't exist though. Let's uh somehow heal him. I guess the healing's going to have to be done over time. If my wyvern dies, I'm going to be pretty upset. Let's increase his weight. I should have put more into his attack damage, but whatever. He's already doing 29. Not quite as much as in a, our secret weapon. But, whoa. That looks gruesome. Screenshot! This looks so cool. 1,483. And he can still level up. Let's uh, get Zubat to follow us. Come on Zubat. Okay, and I'll meet you guys back at my ship, and we'll end off the episode there. Darn it, Zubat. was somewhere here.
Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button and comment down below what was your favorite part. If you want to see more of my content, hit the subscribe button. And let me know what you want me to do next episode. And I'll see you all later. Bye! For real this time.